It's food o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we're going to be taking a look at some Filipino pork scratching. I was in Cardiff just last week and they had this Asian shop in the middle of Cardiff and I thought, oh, let's poke my head in here. And they had all sorts of, it's a bit like Tiger Tiger or the shop Tiger where you can pick up all bits and pieces, but they had a food section. So you could buy like Korean teddy bears and uh, the Japanese pencil cases and it was an Asian themed shop and then they had a food section so of course went down the food section and I've googled it and these seem to be from the Philippines so they're called Kai Na Shisharon Pork Crunch this is the jalapeno flavour version now we have two flavours here that they might be very similar. They look very similar. Maybe they're just a bit a bigger bag. But we have Shisharon Pork Crunch Kyop Mu. And that's Kyop Mu as well. So maybe, I don't know, I don't know what the difference is between these two. Although these look these look darker. Like they've been cooked a little bit more. That looks like original pork crackling. Pork scratching, of course. Of course. Pork scratching. Pork crunch. Different thing. And then last but not least, we have the spicy vinegar flavour. They're from Asco Foods in the Philippines. 70 grams in the big bags. And, oh, 90 grams in the small bag. Isn't that amazing? So we're going to start off then, I think, with the... The 100... They're all different size grammage bags. These are the 100 grams. We're going to start off, I think, with the original flavour of these... Pork crunch things. Here's a look at them. Very light and airy. Mm. Oh. Immediately, massive fan. Mm. It's a very light, crunchy. Oh, that that tastes terrific! Really nice and salty. They're just lovely, just lovely and light and salty. Few beers. Reason why I bought them, to be honest, was to review them, and then save the rest when I have a few beers. Maybe at the Stone Crow Virtual Pub. Hmm. They're delightful. Absolutely delightful. Now let's go in. Now this is pork scratching. Yeah, look at the difference. Look at the difference in that. It's heavier. There's more weight behind it. There's more of the skin on here, I think. Mm. Yeah. Much crunchier. Oh. Look at this piece. Mm. Less salty. I think a little bit less salty. More of the oils coming through. More of a traditional kind of British scratching, if you like. Mm. If 
fabulous. Creamy, they're creamier. There's a little bit more oil coming from the the scratching rather than the the light and airy feel of the pork crunch. Oh, see, okay, so now this is a bit of a gamble. Spicy vinegar or jalapeno. Let's go jalapeno. Again, lighter, much, much lighter pork crunch here. Oh, smell, they smell fantastic. Mm -hmm. I love jalapeno. I love the, the feel and the initial taste of jalapeno. If there was one spice that tasted like greenery or, or, or like it should be chucked in a stew, it's jalapeno. But then on the back end, there's a big kick of spice. Mm. That just keeps coming and coming. Look at that spicy dust in the bottom of the bag. Trying to get some more of that spicy dust on the on the jalapeno pork crunch here. Mm. Lovely. These are my favourites so far. Oh, ho, ho, ho. That jalapeno has a lovely, lovely spicy kick. I think this is the first time I'm having spicy pork crunch. Oh, they're amazing. Oh. And a nice burn on the throat as well. We're going to finish things off then with the spicy vinegar flavour. So the, the pork crunch, as I mentioned, it, it's just really light and lovely. But the benefit of the jalapeno, if you're the spice lover, you're just going to love it. A lot, a lot less dust in the bottom of the bag. These are paler, a lot paler in colour. Spicy vinegar. Yeah, it's coming through. Oh yeah, oh, ho, 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 it's coming through. Mm. Goodness me, wow. Oh, oh, wow. Mm. That is catching the back of my throat, and I can feel the spices making their way up to my nostrils. I can feel the spice hitting my nostrils. <clears throat> Fabulous. Absolutely fabulous pork crunch here from the Philippines. I paid one pound fifty a bag in this in this Asian shop, so there was it was six pound for the four bags. But I got loads of pork crunch now to get on with, loads of it. I think my favourite was the jalapeno, followed by the spicy vinegar, followed by the crackling. The little blue bag of crackling there, followed by the, the original flavour pork crunch. But they are all terrific and they're all worth the money. I've had a little look as well, you can pick this stuff up on Amazon, um, 
EB. If you're a big fan of pork crackling or pork crunch as they call it, and you like a few beers with it, that stuff is fabulous. I like all that, so give it all the 9 out of 10. So 9 out of 10 from Real Ale Craft Beer. Please put your comments in the comments box, subscribe to our daily beer and food reviews, give us a big fat thumbs up. Boom! Cheers!